What's up hair bosses? It's your hair business's best friend, Mikey. And today I'm gonna to talk about why having a website for your hair extension business is absolutely crucial for you to win. Yeah, I get it. I know you've seen people really successful on social media. They're posting all this stuff. They're getting like cash app money, stuff like that. It's not gonna work, okay? You have to have a home base for your business, a home base online. You can't just live on social media. It's not gonna work. You're not gonna be successful. Now, there are some things coming out with the Facebook shops and being able to shop on Instagram, but there's nothing gonna be better than having your own website. Choosing the right platform when you get started is absolutely crucial. You don't wanna build up your brand and your presence online on a website and have to change the platform. So at Private Label Extensions, we really only recommend two platforms. That's Shopify and WordPress. And the extension for WordPress to make it an e-commerce site is uh, WooCommerce. So both of those work really, really well. I know they do a lot of ads for Wix and Big Cartel, Squarespace, and a bunch of other websites. I'm telling you, for e-commerce, you have to be on these two platforms to be successful. There's, there's no way around it, and I'll tell you why. Shopify and WordPress is your foundation, okay? Now, you could have Squarespace as your foundation or Wix as your foundation, but that's just your foundation. And you wanna build this big house or this big building. Think of that as your business, okay? If you have a good foundation, that's a start. But I can tell you, just having a foundation, it doesn't matter if it's Shopify, Wix, or whatever, it's not enough to be successful online. It's gonna be the, the building blocks that you use. It's the apps that you install. It's either a Shopify app, on WordPress they call it a plugin, that's gonna supercharge your website. And that starts building up from the foundation and can make you successful online. As far as app development goes for Wix, Squarespace, and some of these other ones, it's just not there. I'll give you an example. Just a couple weeks ago, Facebook did announce that they're doing Facebook shops and then you'll be able to shop on Instagram. Who do they partner with? Who's the main integration? It's Shopify. Zuckerberg, the CEO of Facebook, was on live with Toby, the CEO of Shopify. They're friends. They get together. They're creating this whole platform and ecosystem for you to be successful selling online with their platforms. So this is really, really important. Also, the way you can do the advertising with Facebook and Instagram is really important to have a website because with the Facebook pixel, you can track users' interactions on your website. Just to give you an example, have you ever been to a website and you looked at a couple products and then you were on Instagram and you were like, wait, I was just looking at these. Is Instagram reading my mind? No, it's just tracking everything you do. And the goal of that is hopefully later on when you're maybe not busy, you're gonna order one of those products. Without the website, it's really hard to do this stuff. It's the same thing for collecting SMS text messages. That's a huge way to market your business, okay? Collecting email addresses. Email is not dead. Where's the easiest way to collect them? On your website. What about SEO, search engine optimization? You're not gonna SEO your Facebook page or your Instagram page. It has to be the website. Google sends us free traffic, thousands of users every single day because we built up our SEO and our blog posts on our platform, which we're currently using both Shopify and WordPress, depending on which website you have. I know with if you guys know me and you know private label extensions, we have a lot of different brands uh, in the hair industry. We use a lot of different platforms. Well, only two platforms, but we have a lot of sites. So it's really, really important for you to think about your foundation for your website. If you're watching this on June 9th, 2020, you'll know that Private Label Extensions has pledged $100,000 to the black entrepreneurs in the hair industry, and we are helping grow their businesses. 
Now, part of the promotion that I have in our Facebook group, and if you're not part of the Start a Hair Extension Business Facebook group, I'll put a link below. We're giving out a coupon for 20 free Shopify websites that are available on dropshipbundles.com. I'll put another link below. So if you're looking for that coupon, the coupon code is foundation. Having a website is gonna incur some costs. If you're using WordPress, you have a hosting cost. If you have a Shopify, it's kind of like a hosting fee, uh, but it starts at $29.99 on Shopify. But what's great about Shopify is it also offers 24 seven customer support. A lot of times with WordPress, you're gonna have to hire an outside developer or someone to steer you in the right direction. Uh, with the Dropship Bundles clients, we do the absolute best we can to help our clients but we don't really go into too much development work, but we have a partner that we work with that we can refer you to. So think about that. Also, you're gonna have some costs with getting some of these other plat plugins like you know the email, the text, uh, Facebook ads, doing all this kind of stuff, but that's really part of a business. The key is for you to plan. Now, there are some things that you can do that's not gonna cost a lot of money, but it's gonna cost time. That's always gonna be the trade-off with any business. You're either gonna be spending the money or you're gonna be spending your time. And if you're just getting started, you're probably gonna be spending more time than money until your business can start generating the revenue, which you should always reinvest back in your business. Over at Private Label Wholesale, our wholesale hair solution, we always talk about one thing, buy, sell, repeat. It's the same thing when you're selling on your website. Whether you're doing uh, drop shipping, where a team is packing and shipping the orders for yourself, you know, we do drop shipping for thousands of clients, or if you're buying wholesale hair and you're packing and shipping orders yourself, either way, you need to continue to reinvest in your business, reinvest in your website, to continue to grow your business. A lot of people will start seeing some success and take the money out too early. The also key with your website is you're gonna have to be absolutely consistent. You'll see this through all my videos, all my interviews. I talk about how important it is for you to be consistent in your hair business. And it's not just the hair business, anyone in business, consistency is key. If you have any questions about getting started with your website, feel free to leave them in the comments below. I'll do my best to give you an answer. And if it's a really great question, maybe I'll make a video about it. Thanks so much, Hair Boss community, and I'll be back soon with another video.